sit down for this one. Mike Lindell has found evidence of voter fraud. What? Has he paid that $5 million to the guy who uh, he challenged, who was incidentally a supporter of Mike Lindell's, Mm -hmm. but he happened to have computer skills. Um, He made a challenge, $5 million, if you can prove that there was no voter fraud and this guy sat down to do it as a lark. He proved it. And I think like in the latest round of the legal battle, Mike Lindell is into this guy for five million bucks. I mean, maybe Lindell is just hoping that he can continue to uncover evidence of voter fraud, like announce it every few months until he finally dies and doesn't have to pay any of this money. (laughs) Here is, and incidentally, Lindell is not allowed on any uh, like network with any um, lawyers, lawyers, (laughs) because he has implicated all of them in suits that may bust these companies. And so he only can go on Steve Bannon's program where apparently like uh, Steve Bannon is um, has enough shell companies that he's protected yeah. from liability. He's got his Chinese uh, sugar daddy, though. Exactly. Like, uh, I'll just shut down the uh, Real America's voice and it'll come back tomorrow as um, the Real American voice. Or yeah. And, and Bannon's also basically awaiting trial for certain things with like the we oh. build the wall. Uh, oh, is he still awaiting trial yeah. for that? And, yeah. And the, that uh, and the contempt of Congress uh, uh, charge as well because he refused to testify. This is all like yeah. there's so many people who are just like be- betting it all on. Yeah delay and trump gets elected and that's the way i'm going to stay out of prison that's my defense strategy right but here he is with mike lindell and mike lindell had some earth-shattering newt it turns out there wasn't just fraud in 2020 the fraud was also in 2022 what the ability he does have the ability to um he does have the ability to uh force by not passing this to to force a uh to force a confrontation just don't pass it. This thing's an abomination. It, it turns back everything that we've uh, we've worked for. Oh, pause it. Okay. Incidentally, he's talking uh, about uh, uh, Mike Johnson. He didn't want him to pass the uh, budget. Um, yeah, he called he, that like disgraceful. Close the government. Very, very yeah, shut down the government. I mean, he's consistent at least. Mike Lindell is going to join us. Uh, is Mike up? Mike, we got Mike Lindell. Mike, uh, Kurt Olson gave a magnificent presentation today about the Fincham. Uh, Kerry Lake situation. Uh, walk us through. We know you're the machine guy. Okay. My question was why no. Sorry. You got a comment got- on the lion and. Yeah, Jesus. That's Jesus with the thorns cross, right? But wait, who's the lion? I don't know my um, my fundamentalist uh, like in like. Is that just like a comp? It almost looks like Aslan from well, the Lion let's of go the Wardrobe. <laughs> we will be able to get more information. The Lion of Judah. We'll, oh, okay. Oh, is that what it is? Yep. Okay. We'll, we'll get more information when we go to the wide shot. That tracks. That tracks. Are there lions in uh, in Israel and Palestine? No, I don't think so. Not like climate change. Okay. Kurt Olson gave a magnificent presentation today about the Fincham uh, Kerry Lake situation. Uh, walk us through. We know you're the machine guy. My question was why nobody found this, but more importantly, what do you guys intend to do with this? We've got a couple of minutes here. What do you intend to do with this? Well, we can. By the way, everybody, go to lindellplan.com. You can find out everything we're doing and help out. Um, what we're doing, first of all, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be doing a massive promotion of that the case is there. Pause it. I just can... also wanted to say, don't take him down. I just, I just want to, I just want to, I want to say like, kudos for not offering a coupon code at that break. He couldn't, like, there was a lot, like, he, he moved, good for him. He's biting his tongue. I mean, I help mean, us out. I mean, we know what that means. Get, I, get your wallet out. Perhaps you spoke too soon. Yeah, maybe we'll get one. See the evidence and see what's out there with these machines and with the decryption codes, everything that was inside it, or decryption keys. Um, you got the Supreme Court. Now, will they accept it or not? We don't know. I know you asked Kurt, you know, what are the odds? Well, we're an anomaly so. in history, everybody. These Supreme Court justices, their their fathers, their mothers, their grandchildren, they have grandchildren, they have neighbors. They're there to protect our country. So let's we'll just have to wait and see on that. <laughs> we will take everything back to Eric. Hang, hang on. Have you? Have you? I realize. I realize you got to go to back to Arizona. Have you called the Fox guys and shared this information with Fox management? Have you called the Murdochs and say, "Hey, I found the solution. You can go get your money back." 
Oh, I will be doing that, Steve. That's uh, number one on my list. Um, I'm going to be doing that this week. We're doing the big push. All the media outlets, including Newsmax, by the way. I'll be re I'll be reaching out to Chris Ruddy uh, to because we've got to get the word out about this. And and Steve, go, you asked uh, earlier in the week. Pause it for a second. Asked, I just want to be clear. <laughs> Steve Bannon said, "Hey." With all this new information you have, did you contact uh, Fox and uh, so that they could get all the money back from that lawsuit that they lost? I think they'd be interested in that, honestly. Oh, that's on my list. That's how I'm definitely going to do that. No, that's actually what's the uh, first thing I'm going to do. I had to come on here. And then I'm going to make the phone calls to save them hundreds of millions of dollars because I figured they'll probably be excited about it. Get on Bannon, plug the URL, then go to the Murdochs and Newsmax to help uh, with the, uh, the exp exculpatory defense. I'm, 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 I, was, I'm, I already called them. I mean, I'm going to call them. Call them. I'm going to call them. And uh, I just need to. Part, part of the problem is I didn't have a stamp, so I couldn't mail them the information that I had because I didn't have a stamp. It's very difficult to buy stamps now because everybody does things digitally, but of course I'm not going to send it digitally because they're watching my computer. Computers, you can't trust computers. So yes, the short answer is yes. It's just I got to find a stamp and it's like write them number one on my list. Get a stamp. And yeah. also envelope. Like I got like, because I don't want to fold it. It's a lot. It's thick, it's thick paper. I could put it in a, uh, a manila, manila folder, envelope. Steve. I could do it that way, <laughs> but I don't have any manila envelopes. So, and then I've got to figure out what the postage is. So, but the short answer is yes. Go ahead. About what if the Supreme Court turns it down? Is there a thing you can do in Arizona? Absolutely, we're going to be taking it back to Arizona. We can do a whole new case, actually, with this evidence for the 2024 election to uh, completely do an injunction against these uh, devices and these voting machines. Also, we're going to be using this information in every case in the country, including all the lawfare lawsuits that they've got against my pillow and everybody else out there that don't deserve these uh, attacks by uh, by these companies. So we're gonna, this is the most explosive shocking so, evidence okay. that's come out so, so, so put, people are pushing forward talk to us we got two minutes talk to us about deals people want to know about what's in it what's in it for them right now talk to us about deals yeah. Well, the, for all your support, everybody, I, my pillow is pillow.com backslash warm or just go to the war room square. But we're having the biggest sale we've ever had. It's a $25 extravagant there we go. war room special. This is exclusive because we're giving you free shipping on your whole order here at the war room. And if you go if you go there, use promo code war room. And if you go to the website, all these square, each each one, you have the uh, the my pillow too. There we go. The that is for a second, this is um, just amazing. Like, so they have slide sandals there. I worked at uh, uh, um, Old Navy for a year in college, and I'll say they sold flip flops there, and they sold them for a lot less than twenty five dollars. No, no, no. Okay, so <laughs> yeah, I, dude, I have those not factoring in the code. Those Adidas sliders, I have those. I recently got a new pair for my trip, my beach vacation, and those are the same thing. And they're Adidas branded, and they were, I think, eighteen dollars. Yeah, yes. yeah, but these, these, and it was originally nineteen. It was originally a hundred dollars. If you are paying a hundred dollars to Mike Lindell for slide sandals, good. good no, great. you guys don't get it. These are the ones that Jesus wore. Oh right, I forgot. Which yeah. color did he wear though? All of them. I just love how like uh, I don't want to detract from the biggest news story that we have ever broken. However, slide sandals, uh, twenty-five bucks. <laughs> Dog beds, twenty five bucks. Two pack multi use my pillows. Honestly, this is the nicest thing. Bucks. Like this is the most human Bannon has been doing like an obvious favor for somebody who was down on their luck like this. Oh, if you don't think he has a piece of this. <laughs> if you don't think he Maybe has a piece of this, I'm Bannon. sorry. You oh. don't think he has a piece of this? Yeah. You think that Bannon's not wetting his beak oh, on this? God. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Matt. I like the idea of multi-use my pillows. What's the second use for a pillow? I also love the I love the the transition where Ben's like, "All right, no more of that. Let's get to the deals. What's the promo code, Mike?" People want the deals. Yeah. That's what they're here for. Let's hear more. I want to hear more. 
Caterpillar pillows, $25. The towel sets, six packs, $25. All the new kitchen towels came in, $25. Sandals and slides. This is a pre-sale. This is They're already in, but this is the spring here. $25. They're Whoa. normally like $79. Those, those rolling oh, wait, wait, scroll up, with scroll American- up. They're not normally seventy nine. They were either ninety nine or four. Or, yeah, they were ninety nine. They split the difference. Seventy nine, yeah, forty nine, whatever. Who cares? Go ahead. Slides. This is a pre sale. This is they're already in, but this is the spring here. Twenty five dollars. They're normally like seventy nine. Those those the roll and go anywhere pillows, with American <laughs> flag and that. These you get two of them for twenty five dollars. Dog beds twenty five dollars. The twenty five dollar my pillow premium. This is what started it all. That king size queen size doesn't matter $25 beach towels $25 it's a, it's a $25 extravaganza free <laughs> shipping on your entire order at the war room and uh, at the war room posse and also we put all these other specials at mystore.com everybody and then you can use that promo code war room over there too uh, the 800-873-1062 I'm back in Minnesota fill up them phone lines they're all downstairs I'm going to go down there and I'm going to talk to get to come get the uh, feedback on how they love the war room posse. I think I think tomorrow morning we'll get you on the factory floor. How's that sound? Mike Lindell, mypillow.com promo code. This is all this being drop shipped up. from some like exactly. This is all like oh this is God. all uh, whatever the yeah. full on bottom of the barrel type of situation. Well, it's That's like fantastic. It's it's one of those things where people like like I've read you know like Real Housewives will start their own clothing line and then you realize that it's just like. There's these companies it. that make kind of generic t- kind of products, right? But they do it under the shadow and allow people to purchase it wholesale and then brand themselves with it. I'm pretty sure that's the kind of like bargain basement situation that that Mike Pillow has no, forced himself into. Yeah. I think just, he's uh, picking out the uh, synthetics and looking at like, oh, this, oh, or this. Mm-hmm. Bullprog uh, just I am literally just got an ad on YouTube feed for fifteen dollar slide sandal. Oh wow! Well, there you um, go. And I just want to remind everybody: uh, shop dot majority report radio dot com right now. You can head over there and get some uh, great uh, merch. Multi use t shirts, multi use dog collars. There's uh, dog collars twenty five dollars. Multi use hats. <laughs> multi use mugs. <laughs> 